what is up folks welcome back to the channel I hope you enjoyed the previous episode where my wife and I caught a beautiful lake trout and uh, we cooked them up in various ways and uh, today is uh, very different today I'm just going to go out and check out a few different spots a few different spots I haven't been for at least 10 years uh, conditions are not ideal but I have the day off so I'm gonna go out and uh, explore the conditions today is four degrees Celsius with snow uh, in the middle of springtime so we'll see what happens uh, I don't expect to catch much but hey um, just want to go out and explore stay tuned everybody Going, guys. Wow. In May. Arrived at our location. I don't have uh, boat access. It's kind of cold today. And uh, I don't see much activity in the water, but we'll give it a go. I'm gonna work the shoreline here. Gorgeous. Got the bobber on. Do some float fishing here. See some weeds. Pretty shallow water here. Let's watch for bobber movement, mainly up and down. So far, nothing. Let's see if we can get some panfish today. Maybe a pike. I'm not going to target pike right now. I'm going to start with my panfish. Conditions are pretty cold today. That's why I didn't put the kayak in the water. Fish took two of my worms already. Couldn't set the hook in time. Got some. What do we got? Yellow perchy. Let's have a look. 
not my biggest. That is a start. Oh, bye fish. There we go. What do you think of this, guys? Yellow perch again? Yes. Yellow perch indeed. There it is. That was a perfect fall, guys. The dangers of bank fishing is real. And you caught that on camera. My goodness. Be careful, guys. I'm out here bank fishing. And I'm soaking wet, y'all. That was a close call. Scavenging a whole bunch of lures. Well, let's, I'm gonna try these, see if they work. Awesome, <laughs> free lures, baby. After surviving a fall, I'm surprisingly alive and well. Not a single bruise. And I've sifted through that junk pile that I found and Got a bunch of oops, the spinner type setup. Definitely gonna use that. Some mini crankbaits. Some more mini crankbaits. This uh, spinner. A phallic looking spinner. I have no idea what that is. Plastics. And a whole variety of little hooks. So, uh, I, you know, fishing is not always about catching fish. It's about the scenery. It's about the adventure. And, uh, well, this is a pretty decent little haul. At least 20, 30 bucks worth of stuff. Okay, let's get back tracking. doesn't show how steep these places actually are. Oh, gosh. Uh, I got this little under the bridge area. Let's give it a try. Just threw out a bait. I don't know what I got. The rapala I threw out. Nice looking fish. What is this? That looks like a that's a smallmouth. It's out of season anyway. So let it go. Then what do we got? A snagged rock bass. My first rock bass of the season. Let's get you back in there, buddy. Snagged rock bass.
a rock bass is going back in the water. Let's get you an underwater release video. Fish on, like a popper bait. What do we got? Rocky, rocky, rock bass. Rock bass people. Yeah, he really choked that. Let's do a little surgery to remove the hook. I didn't wear my waders and uh, I got water in my boot. Here's what it looks like. First of all, it's like a suction cup. It's filled with water. Here we go. Amazing. Encore performance. Not fun. At a very different location now. Using those, uh, some of that lures that we picked up. I got a swim bait on spinner. Let's see if it'll work. A fish on. Got a lot of these today. This is a good one. This is a very good size rock bass. Wow. Good size rock bass. Wow. Very nice. Should we, keep, oops, should we keep this for eating? Maybe not. <laughs> Poor fish handling equals no fish for dinner. Fellow fishermen there, trying to do a little shore fishing. Spinner's all messed up, not spinning. There we go, straighten that out.
That's a good cast. Got it. This is a fatty. Nice rock bass. This is a nice rock bass. When I say it's not bass season, that means like smallmouth and largemouth, but this is not part of that family. This is a very, very nice rock bass. Very nice. Okay, I'm gonna put on the stringer. If I catch a couple more, I might make a meal out of it. Another rock bass. Many already today, but that's not eater. One more look at this really beautiful rock bass. I only caught one, not enough to make a meal, so I'm gonna let this guy go. I'm gonna give you one more underwater release before I head on out. fishing session today went to a couple of places got a bunch of yellow perch and today a lot of uh, rock bass fighting pretty fun day um, almost lost my life falling down glad I survived and uh, caught I found a bunch of lures that I actually used to catch a fish today what do you think I think that was awesome anyways thank you for uh, tuning in and I hope to uh, bring you more content in the not too distant future